so I'll be in Regina this week. I'm going to be speaking at SIIT Regina, bringing the book tour there, but also I'll be speaking for the Ministry of Parks and Recreation at their event this week. I'm super excited about that, bringing the book tour there as well. Awesome times, can't wait. Hopefully we'll see you there. Hey everybody, hope you're doing great in Regina right now. And for every speech that I do, I try to make a plan of what it, the, the, the key points I wanna to touch on. And I take that very seriously. I don't just get up there and wing it and hope for the best. I think that's, um, that's very unprofessional, especially if people are paying you to speak. You have to be prepared. You have to address certain issues that they're, that they're facing and you gotta bring solutions to the table. Uh, so essentially as a speaker, you're a problem solver, you're helping them solve a problem where you're guiding them through a process or a system. That's what a speaker does. So, and I'll, obviously, you, you know, you can tell a story, you can, you can guide them through, through key messages that way. But at the end of the day, you're a problem solver. So if there's any speakers out there who, who are looking for advice, solve a problem when you're up there, tell a story and be interested. I just want to give a shout out to the Ministry of Parks, Culture and Sport. The event was amazing yesterday. I had a chance to be the keynote speaker. Also to SIIT Regina for bringing me out as well. Amazing time. Spreading the messages, the Driven to Succeed to are happening right now. It's amazing. And again, thank you to all of you who have purchased your copy of the book, Driven to Succeed. You can go to my website, Amazon, or to your local bookstore. There should be copies there right now. If there isn't, get them to get some for your store, all right? Talk to you soon. Hey everybody, if you want to succeed in whatever it is that you're doing right now, then you need to make yourself a priority. You got to start working on yourself. You got to start working on forgiving your past. You got to start working on what it is that you're trying to attract in your future. You got to start working on all the necessary steps to get to that goal that you have in the back of your mind. Forgive your past, work on your future, see the goal in the back of your mind, do the necessary steps to get to that goal, write it all out, make a video like this, make a promise to yourself that you're gonna get there and work every single day towards it, every single day. Hey everybody, hope you're having an amazing day. So I'm super excited for next week. Uh, next week on the 9th is the official Amazon launch date for Driven to Succeed. So you can get on there right now if you wanna read the ebook or even the audio, you can listen to the audio book as well. It's available right now. You can get check it out right now. If you wanna get the, the, the paperback book, you can order it there on right now and it'll be shipped out this Tuesday, so pretty awesome. Uh, also, if you're in Saskatoon or in the area, come next Thursday to McNally Robinson, seven o'clock. I'll be doing a talk there and the official in-person launch is at McNally Robinson. Super excited. Hope to see you there. Thank you again for all the support. Everybody, hope you are having a great uh, weekend with family, with friends this weekend. It's Thanksgiving. Hope everyone's having an amazing time. And uh, thinking of and, and being in that moment with your family is one of the is is one of the the biggest blessings. And it's sometimes it can be very difficult to be in the moment especially when so many things are going on in your life. And I know this from personal experience. Many years I battled with this of, of worrying about what I had to do on Monday, worried about what I had to do next week, and forgetting to be in the moment with my, my wife and kids and my, my, my mom and my sisters and so on. So this weekend, do your best to be in that moment. I know I'll try to be. Um, I know it can be very, very difficult, especially with lots of things going on, like I said. But do your best to be in that moment. Your family will thank you and you'll feel better about yourself. Happy Thanksgiving weekend, everybody. Hope you're having an amazing weekend with your family, enjoying that turkey, but most importantly, being there with your family, okay? Have an amazing weekend. Talk to you.